TLO, what's poppin'? We are on kick, K I C K dot com. We are not live, but you can leave a like, comment, subscribe, turn on your post notification bells. Let's continue to grow the family from Chicago to the UK. Uh, right above me is the channel. If you miss the live, you can catch any highlights and things of that nature on there. Uh, don't forget, we do got the Patreon. We post it there five days a week. No Saturday, Sunday. But we also got merch. Appreciate anybody who bought it. Appreciate anybody who inquired about it. And, you know, check it out if you haven't. Um... The link to all of this is in the description below. This, though, Fredo's Chicken Shop Date with Emilia Demeladingenberg. I believe that's how you pronounce her name. I could be wrong. Probably not because I do have one of the best, best, my bad, pronunciation vernaculars in America. Let's get to it, though. Is this how it starts? Yeah, hello. You all right? I mean, uh... Fredo, take the top all the way off the water. What are you doing? Who does this? Right off top, I'm bothered. I'm good. How are you? I'm good, you know. I like that you know my name. Some people forget. No, no, I can't forget your name. Okay, great. Household name. <laughs> Do girls ever call you like pet names? No, no, no. Like Squish? No. Cute, cutie? No, no. Stunning boy? No. No. A businessman. You like girls to call you businessman? I like them to understand the concept. Do you always have to pick up the bill? Yeah. What if a girl offered to pay? Yeah, they do that, but you know, they're just acting. They don't really mean it. They reach for their wa- Facts. Any girl get to start in the pan, like, she don't want you to cheat. It's a test. If you fully let her execute that reach for that wallet and she actually swipes the card, you'll never see her again. For what? It was a test. You failed. Go home. Stay home. <laughs> Is You're done. Wallet. Nah, I say stop. That's hot. Is that hot, yeah? Yeah. I picked up the bill already. For this? Yeah, because you have to pay at the counter. Sam's Chicken 338 Kilbourne, London, London, W... Okay. Is that real? Yeah, it's real. Do you ever leave the house without a watch? Yeah. How do you tell the time? I don't use watches for the time. Oh, right. Yeah, like a bell. Could the watch be like the wrong time? It's always the wrong time. That's probably the richest shit I ever heard. I don't use watches for time. It's like a belt. <laughs> so it's... You got too much money for me, Fred. What the hell? Like a belt. Could the watch be like the wrong time? It's always the wrong time. I've never set, ever set time on my watch, ever. What time does it say right now? Quarter to one. Where's the time? When yeah. we're together, just time stands still. W is? I would never go on a hel helicopter. It's too scary. Yeah, go don't do that. It would be bad if I went on one and I didn't come back. Yeah, I'd miss you. I miss you already, even though you're here. Serious? Yeah. That's, that's right. crazy. I know, it's crazy. Yeah, that is crazy. Are you crazy? Nah, I'm chilled out. Would you ever write a song about me? Would that happen? Could that happen? I don't think so. <laughs> you grew up around here? Yeah, around here. Listening to Mozart. These juices, I had one. They have them at my store. They're disgusting. They don't taste like juice. They taste like water with a pinch of flavor in there. Like, 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 say one is like strawberry. It tastes like water with one squeezed strawberry in it. I pass. You grew up around here? Yeah, around here. Listening to Mozart? Yeah. You grew up listening? Oh. Signed up. That was the ghost of Mozart. Maybe. There's a lot of ghosts around here. What's your view on ghosts? I don't believe in them. You just said there was a lot of ghosts around here. Next question. He was capping. Fruit shoot? Thoughts? It probably won't be the same since they took the sugar out. Did they take the See what I'm saying? That shit was so nasty when I had it. Sugar out? Of everything, yeah. Well, everything in the world, all the sugars have been taken out. No, just the drinks in England. Wow. Yeah, do you know crazy. a lot of facts? Yeah. What other things do you know about? The Great Pyramid of Egypt. What, what, what's going on there? Too much, man. We don't need a whole other day to get into that. 
Do you think you could be a history teacher? No. More like an explorer. What about space? Would you go to space? No. Afraid of the explorer. No. Would you go under the sea? No. The Arctic? No. Just Egypt. So you only want to go to Egypt? Yeah. Have you not been before? No. I'm gonna go next month. Okay. I'll sure. send you some pics. No, I'll be in the pics. Uh, <laughs> don't you think? No, I don't think because I ain't booked you, but if you're going, <laughs> we can link up there, I guess. So how old's your daughter now? Three. Do you have any tips for people who have just had a baby? Make time, be ready to be tired, stuff like that. Is it hard to learn how to change a nappy? No, it was easy for me. Really? It came as an instinct. I've never changed a nappy in my life. You will. I never think about having kids. Some little Amelia's. Yeah. They can have the Titanic earrings as well. If they got lost in the ocean, would you jump in and save it for them? No, no. Yeah, we're not jumping in the ocean. I can't swim. If you, if, if we're on a date and it's by water, and this is our first date, even if it's our second, third, fourth date, and we're by water, and you happen to start drowning by some odd chance, in my mind, I don't know you well enough to jump in there and risk my life to save you. That's that's on you, because I'm pretty sure I got a life vest on. And if you chose to, <laughs> to not put that life vest on, you chose your fate. Do you have a type? All women are nice, all colors, shapes, sizes. Are you a romantic person, would you say? I took my ex to the zoo to be a zookeeper for the day. That's a lot of responsibility. Yo, that was a big step. I thought I'd seen something. Guess not. But for the day. That's a lot of responsibility. Yo, that was a big step. To go to the zoo? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm walking around all day acting like some zookeeper. I really liked her. Do you watch movies? No, I like documentaries about Egypt. Sorry, yeah. yeah. Forgot. Yeah. Who would you think would win in a fight? Me or a chicken? You. Really? Yeah, you Have don't ever seen me fight? At least you got arms, though. You must be able to do something. I got you this. Oh, thanks. What do you think about the price of Freddo's? I don't really care. But do you not think it's sad that this used to be like 15p and now it's like 40p? My issue's more with Air Force Ones. Fat bro. Fredo, don't you own Kick Game, G? I came from a time where Air Force Ones was $80. 85 out the door. White Air Force Ones are a buck 30. Who's paying it? Like nothing has changed. Maybe even a weaker, a weaker leather now, but like one thirty. Okay. They used to be sixty pound now. They're nearly a hundred. Buck thirty in Miami. One thirty. Do you have a toxic trait? Yeah, I got a lot. Like what? I don't know, man. You can't just put me on the spot like this, meaning. Sorry, you haven't asked me any questions. Where'd you get your outfit from? Great question. Um, for real, you're looking like the woman from Titanic. What, Kay Winslet? Just the Titanic woman, the woman that's hugging my man at the end of this ship. Do you like her? I don't really know her. How many times a week do you say I caramba? Why was it? Okay. I don't say that. Never? No, that's not part of my vocab. What does a funky Friday look like to you? I don't have no funky Fridays. So your Fridays are not funky at all? No, not about how I'm living is funky. I'm funky. <laughs> What's funky about you? I'm Wait. funky, funky, funky donkey. <laughs> it's funky. Whoa, whoa, I'm glad you ain't say funky monkey, because... Being funky a bad thing? From where I'm from, if you're funky, then, yeah, it's a bad thing. It was thing. a bad thing? Yeah, you could smell. Oh. You could just be a bit strange. So what's a funky Friday? You have to ask Dave. I just jumped on the song. I thought it sounded good, like I'm having a funky Friday. Yeah, it does sound good, but I don't actually know what he was talking about. Funky. You know, one time you messaged me on Instagram and you said you are going to give me a top. What, a PG top? Maybe. Oh, yeah, yeah. I'll bring that for you. Well, at first you said I've got a tip for you. And I thought you were going to give me some advice. But then you just miss misspelled top. Yeah, that happens a lot. I mean, I've got thick fingers. 
Can you or, dance? No, I don't dance. What, do you do like sway? Yeah, kind of sway. Shoulders? Yeah, kind of shoulders. Click? No, no, no. clicks. No. no clicks? No, you're always pushing it every day. Sorry. I don't like trying new things. Do you want to go to Egypt? But that's not different, that's a big part of my life. Fredo is a man of few words. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? I would be interested to see him in an interview with Bobby. That'd be funny. Do you still like going shopping in Harrods? No. Nah. What happened? You know, everything changes. One time I went to Selfridges and I just stood around waiting for you to see if you'd turn up. Serious? Yeah. That's crazy. I got you a present, though. Oh, thanks. I'm gonna keep them. It's a Harrods teddy bear. I appreciate but it. But do you actually hate this now? No. Nah. Okay, here you It's go. the thought that counts. There you go. Did you get me anything? Did you get what did you get me? No, nah, I'm not gonna lie, I didn't get you nothing. Okay. <laughs> this is what it Pre your presence is her is her present. You get me? It feels like. This is what it feels like, yeah. To fall in love. <laughs> <laughs> hey Fredo, tell her leave a like, comment, subscribe, turn on your post, don't go.